Hi, I'm Elsa Benton and I'm an ice core analytical scientist here at the British Antarctic Survey. So ice cores are formed when snow falls down on, on top of the ice cap. And that snow traps inside it just pockets of air which are representative of the atmosphere at that particular time. What I personally do is take one of the pieces and melt it down on a hot plate and it's connected to a series of peristaltic pumps. So once I have my liquid sample, I divide it up into the different chemical channels for analysis. And that ranges from anything as simple as conductivity detection, so how salty the water is, uh, to dust particle counting using a laser particle counter. I measure hydrogen peroxide by fluorescence detection. I do my elemental analysis of the chemical constituents using an inductively coupled plasma mass spectrometer. And I measure the major anions in my chemical sample using a fast ion chromatograph. We're particularly interested to see how the, the last 50 years of anthropogenic warming fits into a bigger picture and whether indeed the recent warming is significant over a longer time scale and whether it's significant in terms of a spatial scale as well. So then we can get a picture of um, how our seasonal cycles have evolved over the last tens of thousands of years and, and actually we can look at um, hundreds of thousands of years going back to the, the last couple of ice ages. In fact the oldest ice core to date covers eight ice ages.